In this tutorial, we'll look at how to access the Westlaw International materials via Westlaw UK. From the main Westlaw UK homepage, click on the Services button at the very top. From here, choose Westlaw International. A new window will open, taking us into the US and international content of Westlaw. From here we have a few options. If you have a particular case you're looking for and you know the citation, you can type it into the Find by Citation box at the top of the screen. If it's a US case or from a different jurisdiction, remember to change the selected country. So that's found me one case, the direct case I was looking for. When you're in a full text document in Westlaw International, you can use these icons to print, email, download or view as a PDF. If I want to look for US legislation, I'm going to click on the US Research tab. And from here I'm interested in the United States Code. I'll look at the Table of Contents. And from here I can browse to the chapter I'm interested in. And then specifically going right down into individual sections. Again, at full text level, I can print, save or email. I'm going to go back to the Westlaw International main tab and this time search across all of the law reviews and journals which are available on Westlaw International. This will include the US, UK and other international titles. To search across everything I'm going to choose the World Journals and Law Reviews section. You'll notice I don't get such nice search boxes as I do in Westlaw UK, just one big box in which to enter my search terms. But you can use the connectors or expanders below to phrase your search in the terminology that Westlaw would like. So I'm going to do a search for insolvency slash s restructuring. Slash s stands for in the same sentence. So I want any articles where the word insolvency and the word restructuring appear in the same sentence. This has found me over 1300, obviously way too many for me to look through. So I'll go back and edit my search. I might choose now to choose a particular field, in this case the title field. And repeat my search for insolvency and the word restructuring appearing in the titles of articles. Now this has found me 22 results. One main difference with Westlaw International for journal articles, where the full text is available you're taken straight into the full text article. Your search terms will be highlighted so you can see why it's uh, appeared. I'll go back to the Westlaw International front page. If you need material from other jurisdictions, you can browse your way through a geographical 
categories in the International Worldwide Materials. International, uh, sorry, individual country materials. Please note when you get to this point, although a com country's name may appear in this list, it does not necessarily mean that you will have access to complete case law and legislation for every country here. Some countries, such as Australia, are very well supported via the Westlaw International Service. However, others are less so. So it's a case of hit and miss, potluck, to see how you get on. There's help available to help you navigate your way around Westlaw International. And if you have any questions or difficulties in using it, do please feel free to email me.